What's up, people? How's it going? Today, we are checking out some Run the Jewels. Aw, shit. Yep. And uh, for you, uh, you guys that are just joining us, we are two boys, one brain cell. Joel Norton and Charles Beeson over here. You guys can, uh, at the end of the video, if you want to have some fun, drop down in the comments who gets a brain cell. And make sure you hit like and subscribe. But for now, a few words for the firing squad. Run the jewels. And this is, uh, to be clear, we're doing the deluxe version of RTJ4. Oh, yeah. So there's one other song after this, I believe. Perfect. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, I just have one question for you that's completely off topic. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. The last song that you played Get your shitty on your away. Spotify was WAP? Yeah, I just played that for you. Oh, okay. You wanted a, you wanted a song for a, a wedding intro. I said, how funny would this be? There's some holes in this hole. <laughs> That's all. Nice try. Is that what that N- was? Nice try. I yeah. I that, oh, you didn't know that was the song? No. <laughs> 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 wow. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for bringing that up, Chuck. Now let's get to this and run the jewels. Perfect. (laughs) I want to tell him no. Every time. I woke up early once again. It's four days straight. I didn't wake you, baby. I just watched you lay. In the radiation of the city sun I am in love with you It is my only grace You know how everything Can seem a little out of place All of my life has seemed to be The only normal state So being a normal never really made me feel the same Being clear about the truth Of being sane and never really been the same I used to want to get the chance To show the world I'm smart Listen that them I should have focused Mostly on the heart I see smarter people trample life like it's a heart. So being smart ain't what it used to be this fucking dark. You ever notice that the worst of us of all the chips? It really kinda take the sheet on people getting rich. Like maybe rich is not the holy ever loving king or nothing. Fuck it, no, we know you're bluffing. You are dealing with the motherfucking money, money runners. That I ever disdain the fortune and fame But the presence of the pleasure never abstained me from any other pain When my mother transitioned to another plane I was sitting on a plane Telling her to hold on and she tried hard but she just couldn't hang Been two years, true fears I probably never be the same This is just a chore not to let myself go insane It's crippling, make you wanna lean on a cup of promethazine But my queen say she need a king, not another junkie, flunky rapper fiend Friends tell her he could be another Malcolm, he could be another Martin. She told the partner, I need a husband more than the world need another martyr. Made in Atlanta jobs, where I used to ride the martyr. With an engine 22 in the front pocket of my brain starter. Trying to make it out the mud as a baby father's much harder. The same children that you love and the daughter court that used to break and rob you. Circumstance would have broke a weaker man, but I put it on my mama. I'm a man of honor and the hardship made me a better money runner. This is what I never heard, never even got a motherfucking word. This is for my sister Sarah, honey, I'm so sorry you were hurt. This is for the dawn, mama took a knock, had to change the locks. Dusted up and brushed off, and I was talk about a boss. For the holders of a shred of heart, even when you want to fall apart. When you're surrounded by the fall, treading water in an ice cold dark. When they got you feeling like a box, running from another pack of dogs. Put the pistol in the fist up in the air, we are dead, swear to God. Black child in America, the fact that I made this magic. Black and beautiful, the world broke my mama hard and she died an addict. God bless me to redeem her in my thoughts, words, and my actions. Satisfaction for the devil, goddammit, he'll never ever have it. This is for the do-gooders that the no-gooders use and then abuse. For the truth tellers tied to the whipping post, left beat by the cruise. For the boys whose body hung from a tree like a piece of strange fruit. Three of them motherfuckers. Uh, damn. <clears throat> First of all, this is a very experimental track, but it is perfect for an outro of, of a album. 
Dude. <laughs> this is the same band? <laughs> For real. Like it's everything so is, different. It is. I love that saxophone in the background. Oh, dude. Oh, that's a nice touch. Dude. That was a nice fucking touch. As soon as I heard it, I was like. And the not one. This doesn't happen often. Not two. But three? Well-placed fucks in this song? Yeah, buddy. They're How not, does that happen? They're not even. They're not overusing it? Yeah. No, normally when you get to the third one, it's you're overplayed. Like, it's yeah. played out there. You're just, you're saying it to say it now. Yeah. It's also a six-minute song. Yeah, that helps. It's really long. <laughs> it's really long. I'm curious to see what kind of funky stuff we're about to get into. Because yeah. I, if they keep going with the flow like this, that's insane. Yeah, but I can't imagine it is. It's gonna Honestly, be some experimental shit. I think. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Honestly, that first musical break. Yeah, I was sitting there. I'm like, oh, Joel's about to be happy because it sounded like it was about to be a big old fat one. And then it wasn't. It was kind of. And it was down. just normal. And I was like, oh. And, but he ended with Money Runner, and then Mike Killer Mike did his verse. Yeah. And then he ended with was it? Did he end with Money Runner, or did LP come back in? And yeah, I think Killer Mike ended with Money Runner, and then LP picked it back up right there. Yeah. And then added to like the first part was just interesting. Yeah. So it's an interesting song. It is. I'm loving the lines. Oh, Lyr- yeah. Lyrically, this this is there's a, a phenomenal. And there's a lot of one liners that are just fun too. For sure. Yeah. And I'm think like this is one of those songs that's like you come upon you listen to the album, and you're like, this is enjoyable. Yeah. But I don't know if it's enough to add to my playlist because it is a very experimental track. Right. Right. Yeah. But it is still loving those just the flow yeah the only complaint i have is when it gets up to that where it should feel like it's about to go hard it just like ooh, dips, dips back down yeah and it, does, like, it just quit, doesn't hit you quit teasing me which makes me wonder <laughs> if that's gonna happen at some point through the song where they're actually gonna hit uh, you and i really hope so yeah even if not i'm still i'm still happy with it but it's definitely yeah send it babe then come on Theatrical. Oh, so pretty. Here's all this experimental this story stuff. For a couple of small time Bingo. hustlers framed by crooked cops and forced to make a run for their lives. Nothing but a bag of money, a stolen Buick Grand National, and each other to their names. <laughs> they ain't friends exactly. These guys have a better chance of killing each other than beating odds. No, sir, they're brothers. And when the chips are down, I really don't think you want to bet against Yankee of the Braves. Yankee of the 
a bunch of experimental shit. Once again, I think this is the perfect way to exit out of the album. This is, uh, without the deluxe version, this would be the end of the album. If it wasn't deluxe. Um, so for me, that that's a very unique way to go out. Yeah, um, honestly, yeah. if there was ever a time for a long solo like that, doing it, like, right after the halfway point is a good time. Yeah, yeah. Like, I didn't, I didn't dislike it. The sax solo? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was like, so unique. There's a little violin in there, too. A little violin, yeah. I thought, I was like, damn. Some nice touches. Yeah. But definitely, like, an experimental outro piece, you know? Oh, yeah, 100%. Um, I, I really love their flow, though, at the beginning. I, I, I'd i probably go uh, 6.9 out of 10 okay. here, but it doesn't make a playlist just because it's experimental. I, I think yeah. is it like when I'm listening to the whole album, this would definitely get listened to, but just the, uh, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to go 5.8 here mm-hmm. and also does not make a playlist for me because it's very experimental. Just like you said. Yeah. Um, mind you, most of the parts that I would want to skip out on in the song is that second half of the song. Yeah. Um, I did like how they flowed there towards the beginning of the song like that. It was very interesting. Yeah. And I love how most of the song was about, you know, his mama. Yeah, them. Yeah. Yeah. Them. Yeah. Yeah, like the them personal. Whole. Yeah, 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 100%. Yep. Yeah, no, that's, def- that's def- better. definitely wasn't bad at all. It does just, uh, like I said, yeah, outro piece. 100%. And I definitely, anytime I'd listen to the album, this would still get listened, mm-hmm. still get played for sure. Yep. So that means we have one more. Yeah. And that is the uh, song they did for Cyberpunk. Okay. Is it Cyberpunk? The game? The game. Okay. They did a song for that game. Oh, all right. And then it got added to Deluxe. And I was like, well, might as well hit it. Yeah. Um. I played a little bit of Cyberpunk, not a lot. It didn't get a whole lot of good reviews. Yeah. Because of the bugginess, and it wasn't exactly that's, what they promised. Well, that's why I fell out of it. Yeah. I heard they fixed bugginess. a lot of it, but I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. All right, guys. Well, uh, there you guys have our rating. We are two boys, one brain cell. And uh, stick around for that next Run the Jewels reaction. Do us a favor, hit like and subscribe. Till next time, peace out. Yeah.